Hi everyone, Paul here with PTZ Optics and I am at the Lancaster Archery Classic, the world's largest sporting event for archers. And they are using PTZ Optics cameras to live stream, not just to YouTube and Facebook, but the video is actually going out in national television on the Sportsman's channel. In this video, I want to show you behind the scenes in the video truck where they're mixing together all the cameras and remotely controlling them with a PTZ Optics SuperJoy controller. I'm also going to show you behind the scenes how PTZ cameras are able to do some really interesting things. For example, in the main broadcasting area where the world's top archers are, PTZ Optics cameras are being used to zoom into the archery targets and give the archers who are hundreds of feet away from the targets a live video preview on a monitor so that they can see how they're doing. They take the SDI video feed back to the television truck and the HDMI video feed to monitors for the archers to see. Out in, this is a very large area, this is the Spooky Nook Sports Complex, and they're using a mix of SDI video, HDMI video, NDI. We are using IP video, right? We're actually looking at the cameras over the network and they're using wireless transmitters. So it's a really good look at how PTZ Optics cameras having that flexibility of an HDMI, of an SDI. They're powering these cameras over ethernet and of course controlling them over the network. In here I'm going to show you where the archers are doing their qualifications and then you'll be able to see where the master archers, the top archers in the world are competing here. So let's take a look. So behind me here is where all the archers shoot for qualifying to be some of the best archers in the world. The PTZ Optics cameras are set up on a pipe and drape system over here where they have wireless Teradek bolt adapters that essentially take the SDI video and transmit it hundreds of feet over to where the broadcast area is. This is a really cool production because we do have ethernet out here so there's a network that allows the broadcasters back in the television truck to control these robotic PTZ cameras. We're using the PTZ Optics Move SE cameras because everything is set up at 1080p at 60 frames a second taking again the wireless video to a transmitter which is then connected via SDI to a Ross Carbonite video switcher back at the television truck. This year they're adding more and more PTZ cameras because these cameras are allowing them to see the faces of the archers. One of my favorite use cases is where they have the master archers shooting at a long range target but those archers can see the targets in a large screen using HDMI right below them. And then the SDI video going back to the television truck, allowing them to have the full 1080p at 60 frame per second video that they use for slow motion instant replay and distributing up to large screen LED walls. Of course, the live stream on YouTube, which I noticed they were using OBS for, so that was interesting. Uh, it's a great encoder for this type of stuff when you're streaming to YouTube and Facebook. And then just the whole television truck is a really cool experience, a great team. They've got comms so they can all communicate and they're putting together a great production on site, but also on YouTube and Facebook.